diamonds on my wrist, diamonds, diamonds on my wrist, worth more than your household. Got a point of pistols on, got a point of pistols on, got a point of pistols on, pistols on, pistols on. Got your mind low, got your, got your mind low, got your, got your mind low, got your, got your mind low. Diamonds on my wrist, diamonds, diamonds on my wrist, diamonds, diamonds on my wrist, worth more than your household. Diamonds on my wrist, diamonds, diamonds on my wrist, diamonds, diamonds on my wrist, worth more than your household. Yeah, it's Cash is back on motherfucking again. You dig? Give me a shout out to Blue Leaf. You know what I'm saying? My niggas been holding me down on the reel for a minute. I want to give a shout out to everybody. The six and the five, the whole Midwest, man. The Moles, the Lords, the Cobras. You know what I'm saying? The, the G's, of course. The BDs, the New Breeze. Everywhere, man. From the Hunters to the Low Ends. From Lion City to Circon. You feel me? Cottage Boys, everything, G. I'm a real nigga. I represent all y'all to the fullest. Believe that. G. You know what I'm saying? First off, you have to remember I'm a Chicago nigga. You know what I'm saying? So a lot of my life experiences I'm talking about is from Chicago. I did I did a year in the county jail in California. I had I had fucking six arrests for counts of robberies. I have multiple fucking assaults and batteries. I had dope cases and all that. You don't believe me? My name is Ramon Johnson. Go check my shit, famo. You know what I'm saying? They go down in Orange County. It ain't all Laguna, Laguna Beach. That's where a nigga trying to live at now. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm living, trying to live closer to that now. But it's not like that. It's broke you to think. That's so so it, it, it is hood out there. It's not I'm not saying that it's, it's nowhere near what Chicago was, but you go to Santa Ana, you know what I'm saying? You go to Tustin. Tustin is the GD capital and and I in, in, in Orange County. Bogus boys, it was already niggas out there doing their thing in 92, 93. I just found out about that's been locked up and 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 you know killed and, and all that shit. And I came in, I'm came pushing the line for my side, you know, just hard, 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 and I end up clicking up with some other niggas recently. And it's cool, you know what I'm saying? I know they been out here doing their thing. They was locked up. I was locked up with niggas, and we got a chance to really meet up. Cause when niggas tell me they GD, I don't believe them. You know what I'm saying? Nigga, like I'm from Chicago. I'm like, yeah, all right. yeah, nice to meet you. I'd be like, if I'm like, hey, what up? I'm from LA. You'd be like, yeah, LA, big as fuck, dog. You could be from Beverly Hills. You know what I'm saying? And Chicago niggas think the outskirts of Chicago is Chicago, and it's not. You know, I'm from the I'm from the inner city. I went to Simeon High School. I'm from like, you know, I went over there right by Stone Sears. And I am G and that's in between us on 82nd and 8235 Vincent's. It's in between Boy Sounds and GD Hood and Stone Tears. You know what I'm saying? I got love from both sides because I'm a real nigga. I'm a real, real nigga. And it go down in <coughs> OC, man. So niggas can get caught slipping in Santa Ana. Niggas can get caught slipping in Anaheim. Niggas can get caught slipping in Garden Grove and Tuss. And they niggas is really trying to be little LA and be on that color shit now. So, you know, we getting to a lot over that. But, you know, I ain't gonna never stop wearing blue, you know, so niggas go out and do what they gotta do to me. But I got love from niggas and niggas got love for me, so it shouldn't be none. But if anybody want it, whatever side you want, G, I'm, I'm about 227, my bogus boy, and Shady Vegas. That's it, that's the line I'm pushing at. You know what I'm saying? Much respect to King Larry Hoover, you doing your time. Much respect to, to, to the new commissioner. Rest in peace to Pac Man, the realest GD that ever was. That was my uncle. You know what I'm saying? He started the Bogus Boy and I brought that to life. And we connected. We got Bogus Boy chapters in New York and Brooklyn. We got Bogus Boy chapters sitting out in Detroit right now. You know what I'm saying? We getting it popping. We starting up here in Cali. We already got 57th and Normal know what's up. You feel me? I'm trying to connect with y'all niggas and get it right in Chicago on the low end. Let's do this. I feel like these rap beefs. I'm gonna be 100 with you. I came in, I came in this shit, and I came in into Shady, like you know the Shady team, the whole thing, like a like a gang. I looked at it like, damn, these niggas is mine. But I mean, I seen the yuck my fence, and I mean, the G got do That's what it do. Ain't no, ain't no cut on mine, you know. You that's what I'm saying. And that's, 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 that's what I love it. So, so I came into it like cool. The same way I, when I got when I got blessed into the boat nation, when I got plugged, nigga, I I came in and I'm, I wanted to make a name for myself. Which that way it was. Whether I was the little nigga that's going up and smack the older nigga, where everybody else jumped the nigga, or something, I wanted niggas to know like, man, I'm about this. So, I was eager to get into the music. You know what I'm saying? Elm and Paul had to talk with me, told me stay out. Fall back. You know what I'm saying? Genuinely got it. Everything is good. But now I'm hearing different songs and 
different different shows where niggas are saying fuck shady and all that. So now you open up that window. You open up that lane you know and it's better. too late. You know better. It's too late. It you wasn't even better. worth it, G. It wasn't even worth it. Niggas was trying to tell me not to do it. Everybody over here is so much better than, than the niggas that, that we beefing with. It, it makes no sense. We giving them, we actually are promoting them by doing it. And and that's that's what we was trying to avoid, but now I'm in it, you know what I'm saying? And that's just a warning. And think what that does, that's all for warning. What could I really do? And I could take it to the street, G. Like, I, I wanted to spill into the street, because I think, like, going back and forth song for song, fuck that. Let's just get it on there, man, if you really want it. I'm just telling niggas, for the last time, don't speak on Shady, don't speak on G-Unit. You can't talk about 50 in the unit and think it's cool, because we in the same fam. So if you do that, you know what I'm saying, you you indirectly talking about me, you indirectly talking about King Mathis. You talking about him, I'm getting this. Man, I'm talking about everybody from the game to... Street niggas, you, whoever, whoever's in beat, Benzino, Zaru's, I don't even, like, all them niggas, see, everybody who had a problem, I'm saying, I'm in this, like, I'm in this, you know what I'm saying, I'm not, I'm not trying to start a career on beat, I'm, I'm trying to let y'all niggas know I got real lyrics, but y'all not gonna talk shit about people that I roll with, and think I'm not gonna do nothing, it's about that time, and you said fuck shady, gang, dog, you said fuck shady, dog, that's some crazy, when you, your first song on your new album, you says M you rhyme Eminem with Eminem. And you sing like 50 on the hook. Like, and you said fuck Shady B. Now it's personal. Nice in the blue room. Blue room in the blue booth. <laughs>